I've been drifting on Forza since about 2007, which is over five years now. What's happened to me over those past five years was actually quite unexpected. Looking back after being a part of DIS for so long, I've had to ask myself a few questions. First, what's it like when a game becomes a bigger part of your life than you ever imagined? You never think about making any actual friends through a video game, but you'd be lying to yourself if you said you didn't consider this group of people some of the closest friends you have. Could you admit that each individual has made an impact on you in some way or another? And could you accept that you let a video game affect your life this much? And do we as a team have what it takes to get through yet another team video project like Light 'em Up? And at what point do you realize the game that initially introduced you all to each other isn't actually what's holding this group of friends together? These are questions I never thought I'd be asking myself. But I guess now the real question is, where do we go from here? DIS has evolved into like a second family. A family that's done so much for me. So this is my thank you to them.
Uh, one of the most memorable moments of BIS for me was when uh, we were working on the first video, Light em Up. I mean, it was frustrating at times, but seeing the seeing the end result of the video, you know, it kind of makes you proud of, to be part of the team and stuff like that. I guess it's it's more than a moment. It's it's a whole period of time. Easily, hands down. Forza two. Forza two. Forza two. Forza two. I think the I sent out from other drift teams just because in the years that we've been together, it's always been the same group of people that have you know, always stuck together through it all. We don't just play Forza together, we play PlayStation 3 together when everybody has it. We play computer games together. Just the fact that we've been a team for so long. Like in football, you acquire players based on skill only. Uh, it's, it's never been like that for us. It was always about who we really thought were long-term friends type people. Yeah, we started out as a drift team, but to me, it's more of a family now. Texting each other, it's not just uh, see each other only on Forza. I mean, it's like an actual friendship rather than just like internet friends. Might sound kind of corny, but it's like a brotherhood. We're not gonna die, you know, we're gonna keep on drifting, we're gonna keep on making videos, doing awesome stuff, so. I say, yeah buddy, rolling like a big shot, Chevy tuned up like a NASCAR pit stop. Fresh paint job, fresh inside, is the outside frame in the trunk wide. All the rims big, do it right good, lean back right hand on the pinewood. Cream on the inside, clean on the outside. Cream on the inside, clean on the outside. When I think of Forza, it's one of the first thoughts that comes to mind is definitely the old Forza 2 days. There's a different vibe coming from DIS than there was any other team uh, on the forums at that time. I think you really had to be there to fully understand, but you know, those are some of the best days I think that we've ever had. But seeing the way you guys brought across your team in your video made me want to do that with, with XC. Pretty cool guys and everything. Pretty, pretty chill. Plus they could drift. Helped them out a lot, dude. I think a lot of people look to them as an example. An example for a team. You get on and have a laugh with a group of friends. That's what Forza Drifting's about. And DIS really capture that essence of it. 
When I joined a team, I always wanted to be kind of like that brotherhood that it seems like it is on DIS. If you don't know what you guys are doing, they can pick their spears. Yeah, when you think DIS, you think a team that's doing it all for the right reasons. Their course through the community over the years, you look back at it and wouldn't be the same without their presence. And you know, in my opinion, they're the best to ever do it. La, la, yeah. la, la, wait till I give my money right.